vandals came in and knocked some holes through that, shattered the windows. Those are some massive windows. That, there's some in there. Hmm. Don't know what that would be. What's up guys? So today I stumbled upon this really cool abandoned dome home and this builder I guess has started building this several years ago and stopped for whatever reason but it is just I don't know I just think it's the coolest thing ever so I'm gonna go take a look at it and I'm gonna bring you guys with me and you tell me what you think of this place. I don't know if the price is right I may buy it so let's go check it out. Check this out. So all of these here are supposedly, I guess they're called storm shelters. And this is the actual home right over here. And this is supposed to be hurricane and tornado proof and all of the above. But uh, let's check these out here real quick. So all of these are completely made out of nothing but concrete from top to bottom. Check this thing out. This is like something you'd see in Greece or something. I don't know. Wow. I mean, most people would look at this and think, what a nightmare. But I look at it and I see endless possibilities. What a cool little like garden terrace this would be with some chairs and flowers all around it. We just have to move it to a different spot because clearly right here on the front of the road is not the place for it. We got several more over here. This one doesn't even look like it was finished yet. This one's got some... Hello! Crazy. Wonder if the door opens. This place has been vandalized, obviously. I'm not going over there, there's too many prickers, but <clears throat> vandals have came and broke all the windows, punched holes in the green board. Over here we got another one. This one's shaped a little differently, but same concept. I'll walk all around it. Let's go look inside. Tar paint everywhere. This could be turned into a whole nother little tiny house living quarters. Gosh. You even have some electrical outlet box up there. That's kind of cool. So that means there's gotta be a wire somewhere going through here. So here we go. I'm gonna walk around the exterior of this first and show you guys the outside before we go inside. Those are some massive windows. Now I'm not sure how many square feet this is, but I want to say around 1200 maybe, maybe a little more. Two glass sliding doors would go back here. Kind of 
kind of quiet little place. Back there is a canal, little waterway that runs through there. It's like all the plumbing is in. Got two little windows on this side and another door. That's so cool. You guys know me, I like non-conventional stuff. Anything that's different from what everybody else is doing. That's where you'll find Jessica. As you can see here, vandals came in and knocked some holes through that, shattered the windows, threw bricks at that. I'm like, why? What's the point? All right, let's go inside and take a look. Very echoey. So yeah, it looks like all the plumbing is in, but I don't think they have any septic or a well yet here. And I'm not sure about the electric. I don't see any wires. Well, I don't know. Maybe those up there, we'll have to look when we get a little closer. So I guess this, I don't know if this would be a bedroom here or what this would be. But you have this little area here. Then you have, I'm assuming these would be two doors maybe? Maybe this would be, yeah, bathroom. This has to be the bathroom. So you have two doors to come through or no, maybe this is a closet. So this would be a closet. This would be the bathroom. And then you have the other door on this side. And I'm assuming this would be like kitchen or living room area. And then vice versa, kitchen or living room on this side. And then this, I'm not sure what this would be. It's kind of small and it has another door there. So maybe laundry area that might be but I don't see any pipes for that. There's some in there. Hmm. Don't know what that would be. Let me walk down here further. And then you have an area for glass lighting doors or French doors. Turn here and I'm assuming you have another bedroom. Just a decent amount of space. And then the view of the backyard, which is an absolute disaster. But it would be nice if all that was trimmed down. You could see the, the water back there. So then again, it's kind of like a, a mirror of the other side. Almost. This here, you have more of a walk-in closet and then your bathroom, sink, shower or toilet maybe, or this might be the shower or toilet, I don't know, but this is definitely a bathroom. So this has to be the laundry area here. This is definitely cool. So I don't know, there looks like there's some conduit up there, so I don't know if wiring has already been put in here or not i'll have to ask oh wait look there is wiring okay so electric has already been ran sorry i don't know you guys what do you guys think of this is this something that you guys would buy purchase something like this to finish and complete to live in or sell or rent out or turn into a really cool Airbnb. I don't know. Let me know down in the comments if this is an adventure that you guys would partake in. But um, anyways, I'm gonna contact the guy and get some more information on this. And who knows, maybe I might buy me a new dome home. <laughs>